Hello everyone, today's video is going to be me making this hamster shelf treehouse type thing. I don't really have a name for it yet but I am going to be making that today and I thought I would film it because I don't know maybe you'll get some inspiration too and I'm not really following any pictures or instructions of anything. I thought I would just sort of make it up as I go along because I do have an idea in my head of how I want it to turn out so hopefully it'll be something like that. Everything for this DIY you can pretty much find at home. Some things you may need to buy but I would say they're pretty easy to get hold of. First of all I'm starting with this IKEA magazine holder. So this is a wooden one so obviously it's a lot more sturdy than the cardboard ones and shouldn't really be gnawed easily by small animals. I also have a bunch of these wooden log type things. Now this is from an old hamster toy so I'm just reusing these basically but I'm sure they're very easy to get hold of in pet shops and there's always alternatives to use if you can't find something exactly like this. The next item I will be using are these lollipop sticks. Now these are just a natural looking colour. I know you get really bright ones but I thought this would be nicer for a more natural theme. I've also got some hamster safe glue. I will also be using this seesaw string I think it's called. Some scissors and finally these two eyelet hooks. So I'm just starting off by gluing about a third of the lollipop stick. And then what I'm going to do is just stick it to the side. white craft glue and this says non-toxic so it is safe to use for small animals. <laughs> because I think this is going to take quite a lot to keep it held together. Now taking another wooden log I'm going to screw these two eyelets into it and you'll see why later. Now what I'm doing is making a ladder out of this string and these small bits of wood, they've got two holes in like that. So I'm just basically pulling these bits through the string. So once you've got through one side it should look something like this. I'm now going to go ahead and do the other side. I've just finished making the ladder and it looks like this. Thank you. 